Well, hey guys, I'm out here today. Uh, it's Tuesday afternoon. Uh, I'm up here at the place I found that uh, silver locket there the other day. And I come out today just to uh, make a video of, uh, of some things that I find. So, I never did that before. I, you know, we're all used so used to uh, just putting on the good things that we find, and and uh, one of my subscribers uh, gave me a little clue, little hint uh, that uh, he would like to see some. Uh, it's not the good stuff. Some of the junk too. So uh, I just got here. Met into a couple other people up here that are detectors. I just never knew them, but just met them, and we're all going to get together and go someday. So, uh, but anyway, I'm down here over below the hill. I found that silver locket up over the hill. There's the ball fields up there and stuff. But I come down over here just to just to hack around, and now I got my first uh, target. And I dug down, and looky there. Now, I imagine this ain't going to be the first one I find, I'm sure of that, but uh, that was my first target, so we'll uh, bag that and we'll get on to the next. Hey guys, back at you. Down over there is where I just came from. A little train. Jump by, just come up over the hill here, and here's my second target, and it looks like it's a. Uh, it's a penny. Woohoo! We're on the board with the first coin. Cool. Alrighty, we'll get back to you. Hey guys, back at you. Uh, there it is. It's a dime. That's my third target. Now I'm not going to tape everything, but uh, just to go to show you. This place up here is polluted with coins, and I'm telling you, it's just like, it's unbelievable. I mean, up here around the playground equipment and stuff, I mean, it's hard not to to uh, get a signal about every swing up around there. So I just come down here where maybe I just don't have to pick up a bunch of pennies. So we're going to keep going, and uh, we'll get back to you. And we're back at you, and I got my first bottle cap. It won't be the last one, I'm sure. Okay, back to you. Back at you guys. Uh, that's the school up there. Uh, that's been here since probably the, I guess the 20s or so. They built it somewhere around that area. That's a. Uh, there's just no, there's just no ground around it much there, but. There is, and uh, I'm going to head up there then and see what I can. I think it's only about the third time I've ever been up here, but uh, we'll give her a shot and uh, see what happens. But anyway, a couple inches here underneath the ground. We got ourselves a quarter. Oh, ching ching. We'll get back to you. Hey guys, back at you again. I just got me uh, got me a first. Whew! Tough getting it out of there too. But look at this, huh? What do you think? I got myself a relic. I don't know what that is. I think it's pretty cool. I just wanted to get it out of the ground. It's got a point on it there. Anybody knows? I thought it was a big key at first. Eh. Pretty cool. Now I gotta carry that thing around with me. Darn. Okay, we'll get back to you. Okay guys, back at you. Got my first nickel, I think. Yep. Oh Jeffy. 1983. Okay. On the board with a nickel. I think I've got one of each now. Wind's blowing, so I'm trying to talk a little loud, so bear with me. We'll get back to you. Hey guys, back at you. It's live dig time. I don't know. I just 
we're going to mix it up here today a little bit. Just going to mix it up. Nice day out here today. There it is. And we got ourselves a Lincoln. Cool. Alrighty guys, we'll get back to you. Find something else. Hey guys, getting back to you again. I found some pennies and stuff and pull tabs and whatnot. And I got I like these kind of targets right here. They're just right just right there, you know what I mean? Yeah, that's the kind I like. Easy pickings. 70, 1970. Yep. He was another six years and that would have been silver. That's pretty clean for being in the ground. But there's another another uh, coin over here somewhere. I believe a nickel or In there. I think it's a nickel, I'm not sure, but we'll see. It's down in there somewhere. Who knows? Oh, there's something there. Oh, there it is. Nickel. Uh, let's see. 41. That'll be son of a gun. Why can that be? A couple years older. That's still pretty, uh, that's you should, at least, I don't know. 41. I don't believe them, them are silver, are they guys? Eh, I don't know. We'll see, but anyway, another one. We'll get back to you. Hey guys, back at you again. You know, I'm having fun at this. I just found this thing. This has got to be the smallest buckle I ever found. That thing is really tiny. Huh. Cool. It's an oldie. Okay. We're just uh, boot scooting around here. I keep looking behind me in case anybody's coming up behind me to boot me out of here. Well, I got news for it. I got permission to be here, so it ain't going to happen. I don't care who it is. So, okay, we're just just uh, going around in here, maybe whoop around, maybe we'll whoop around the swings and stuff, I don't know. Just having fun. Okay, we'll get back to you. Hey guys, back at you again. Look what I found. Wheat penny. Woohoo, first one. First one. It's a 40, I don't know. Oh, it is. Let's turn it Crank up the old macro there a little bit. Okay. Let's see. Can we tell? Uh, 40 something. I can't tell because of the sun. But, hey, cool. It's a cool find. That's not too bad. We'll take that. I ain't got too far. I started down there by that blue trash can. Up we'll here around the front of the batting cages and this is where I ended up at. So, uh, one wheat penny more to the bank. So we'll take it and we'll move on. We'll get back to you. Well, hey guys, uh, I was just headed over there to that Shem Shady picnic tables there. I'm going to take a little break so over there, I found that wheat penny right in there somewhere. I'm just walking this way. Just swinging, getting ready to go over there and have a sit down. And, and uh, got this signal right there. It's on half of it sticking out of the, the ground there. It looks like we got ourselves a, uh, a chain here. It's not down in there. It's just... Keep going, baby. 
be as long as you want to be. Now, what do you think of that? Uh-oh. Well, I sure hope them things are real in there. Huh? Let them babies glimmer. Huh? Sparklies. Well, I don't know what we got here, guys, but uh, I would say probably them there aren't going to be real stones in there. If they are, I'm going to be really excited. I'll check this bad boy out and see if we got any silver. Might be silver anyway, I don't know. That's a pretty big old chain. Okay, we'll get back to you. I'll check this out here a little bit and uh, we'll get back to you. Later, guys. Hey, everybody. We're digging. Uh, buttons. Gary's gotten buttons and one penny so far. I haven't got nothing until I dug this right here. Where's it at? It's one of those uh, Crodo bells. That's pretty cool, huh? Yes, sir. That's all right. I'll take that. I hope everybody enjoys this video I'm making of the weird finds we that I have come upon today. It's pretty heavy. Probably all mudded up. I don't know if the thing's still in or not, but. Uh, Hey, I'll take that. Okay, we got another hour or so. We're going to be at it. And uh, I'm waiting for someone to come out up here so we can get up in there to that yard so I can ask them. That's some old ground there. Okay, guys. Ding a ling a ling. We're gone. Hey, guys. Hunt's over for the day. A uh, quick, dirty wrap up. Two dimes, two nickels. Uh, six pennies, two quarters, one wheat penny, 1940. Um, miscellaneous, I uh, don't know what that is. Uh, has a little writing on it, but I can't make it out. A little square hole in the middle. No, no clue. Pieces of lead, pieces of lead, tiny little buckle. Junk cosmetic jewelry. Uh, I guess the best find of the day was this little Croto bell. Still works. Cleaned it up. So that's cool. So we're off to a new site tomorrow. Hopefully we get permission to do that. And uh, it ought to be a good one. It's a 1800s home. Probably one of the first ones built here in the town I live in. Uh, so we're going to go up and get see if we can get permissions to hunt that. And hopefully we'll have some good finds off of there. So until then, thanks for... Uh, watching. Thanks for subscribing and everybody have a great day. Bye.